tributes continue to pour in as the wake for late actress Susan Rosses opened to the public on Sunday. Camille Samonte with a story. Family and friends in the movie and television industry are mourning the death of veteran actress Susan Rosses. She passed away on Friday. She was 80 years old. Her daughter, Senator Grace Poe, recalled their last conversation. She said her mother was so proud when the foundling law was passed in the Senate. Sabi niya sa akin, congratulations. Sabi ko, no ma, congratulations to you. Kasi dahil sa kanya yan eh, siya talaga yung nagpursige na maging legal ang pag a sa akin. So, yung mga batang inab inabando na, ngayon, pareho ng karapatan. On Sunday, the wake of roses opened to the public at the Heritage Memorial Park in Taguig City. Many fans came in to pay their respect and share their memories with roses. Hindi ko na makita siya. Pakala ko nga, patay na rin ako. Kasi narinig ko sa radyo. Sabi ko, ay, kawawa naman si ma'am. Ami Susan Roses ay down to earth at napaka-approachable. Parang feeling close ka na sa kanya pag dilapitan mo siya. Rosa's co-stars in the series Ang Provinciano also paid their respect and tribute to the veteran actress. Actor Coco Martin recalled how Rosa's treated him as if he was her own grandson. Hindi ba paliwanag eh. Ang hirap eh. Kasi si Tita Susan kasi hindi naman namin na katrabaho lang eh. Kasi siya talaga yung puso ng, ng show namin. Lola talaga namin siya ng lahat eh. Ng, hindi lang ng mga artista kundi ng mga crew sa kaistap. Kaya talagang Hindi makapaniwala. Veteran actors Jaime Fabregas and John Arcilla also shared the learnings that Roses imparted on them. Ang laking bagay na naabutan mo sila sa henerasyon na ito bilang isang artista. Uh, kasi sila yung mga haligi eh, ng, ng pelikula ng Pilipino. Kaya nga siguro siya tumagal dahil doon sa, dahil sa pagtrato niya sa mga taong katrabaho niya. No? At saka yung pagmamahal niya siguro sa trabaho niya. The public viewing for Rosa's Wake will run until May 24. Her family is planning to bury her at the Manila North Cemetery next to her husband, Fernando Poe Jr. For News 5, Camille Samonte, We Are One News.